Welcome. We will be using Mac for this demo. In this video, we will cover how to attach PDF files to your references in EndNote. EndNote allows you to conveniently store and annotate full text PDFs for all of your sources in one place. The Find Full Text feature is a quick and easy way to automatically retrieve and attach the full text PDFs for references in your EndNote library. The first time you use this feature, you will need to do some setup to connect to UTL in order to retrieve the full text. First, go to EndNote 20, click Preferences, and find Full Text. Make sure all the boxes are checked. Enter the appropriate URL paths in the corresponding boxes. You can find the current URL paths on our EndNote guide at this link. Click Save and close the dialog box. Now we're ready to go. To search for the full text version of a reference in your library, first, select or highlight the references for which you want to find the full text. Then click on References and find full text, and find full text again. If you are off campus, you may be prompted to log in with your UTAR ID and password. A paperclip icon will appear next to each reference for which EndNote was able to find the full text. To view the full text PDF, click on the reference and the PDF should appear in the panel on the right. If you don't see it, you may need to adjust your display settings. While a very useful tool, the full text feature isn't perfect. For PDFs that could not be found automatically, you can manually attach them to your references. To do this, first select the reference for which you would like to attach a PDF. Then click on References, File Attachments, and Attach File. Select the PDF from its location in your files and then click Open. When you click away from the reference, you will be prompted to save your changes to the record. Click Save. As with the Find Full Text feature, you'll notice that a paperclip icon now appears next to the reference, and when you select the reference, you can view the PDF in the citation panel. If you are having trouble finding or accessing the full text PDF of an article, contact your librarian for help. Once you've attached the PDF, you also have the option of annotating it and saving your changes directly in EndNote. At the top right of the PDF section in the side panel, click the pop-up arrow to view the full-size PDF. The full-size PDF will open in a new window. Along the top, you'll notice a number of options for modifying and editing the full-text article. To edit, Open the Annotation Toolbar, which is the third button on the top left. This is where you will find options for highlighting text, adding comments, and more. To highlight, click the Highlight button, then click and drag your cursor over the desired text. To add a comment, select the sticky note icon, and then click on the location in the PDF where you would like to add a comment. A sticky note appears. Double click on the note to open the comment box and type your annotation. Click the X icon in the top left corner of the note to close your comment. This will automatically save it. To open and view it again later, just double click on the sticky note. When you're done editing, Close the PDF to return to your EndNote library. When prompted, click Save to save your changes. You have now completed this video. Thanks for watching.